and exhibition designers Claire Graham and Bob Breen, they looked at the 6,000 Eames uh, photos that we took over this four-year period, photographer Grant Taylor of Santa Fe, New Mexico, and they said, let's highlight the part of the uh, chairs that people can't see when they're on the pedestals, which are the underside. And um, that's a message unto itself uh, when you look at them uh, uh, closely. Uh, for example, in this uh, uh, picture, the uh, second from the bottom, you see the, uh, uh, the upholstery pad for Eames wire chairs, as the Eameses did it from 1951 to 1956, where they had a, uh, a hemp backing to the pad. And uh, when you look over here, you see a post-1957 Eames wire chair. And Charles and Ray took the same approach to the wire chair upholstery that they took to premium face veneer. Instead of uh, simply having the part where people don't see be a, a common material, by 1957 they said, you know what, let's, let's put the same uh, premium upholstery material on the underside of the pad that we have on the top side of the pad.